Hello Happy Meal Toy fans, I'm back with another Happy Meal Toy review featuring McDonald's Happy Meal Toys from the new movie Night at the Museum 2 Battle of the Smithsonian and for today's Happy Meal Toy review I have Rexy who is also known as the T-Rex um, the fossil, uh, the T-Rex is made out of pretty much fossils that comes alive from also featured in the first movie so that's Rexy and he is number three in the series of eight uh, different toys from Night at the Museum, Battle of the Smithsonian, Happy Meal Toy series. So, your standard average Happy Meal toy bag. So, let me just open them up and do the review. Okay, these are pretty, pretty big toy. Of course, these uh, Night at the Museum uh, toys do come, of course, with a flyer and, of course, instructions for the toys. Um, all of these Night of the Museum uh, Happy Meal toys come with a, a trivia card, and um, kind of uh, not only do you wind up the toy, but you also insert the card somewhere into a slot in the toy, and they they get to do their action feature. So it's pretty cool. I see that they're trying to do some more innovative things even if it is as simple as a Happy Meal toy. Let me just bite this plastic off. Try to cut it. Can't even open it. Oh, come on. Okay, for whatever reason, my hands are slipping today. Fingers, I got butter fingers. Okay. Wow, I don't know why my hands are like my fingers are can't seem to grip on plastic today. Okay, here we finally go. I apologize for that. So, uh, here's a cool trivia card featuring Rexy. Um, it says here, uh, let's see. This, uh, this is really, really a spoiler, but uh, from the first uh, movie, it's also featured there if you've seen it. In the movie, Rexy is really big, a really big puppy dog. He wags his tail and his favorite game is Fetch, which has been featured in the first movie. So, there's some other trivia here that I, um, I want to I wanna, wanna read, because if you do pick it up, you'll... Find it out for yourself. I don't want to spoil it or anything like that. So, okay. So it says to wind up the toy, and there's a there's a winder here, a wind up, um, not really a button, kind of a lever, not really a lever. I don't want you. Okay. So once you wind it up, and um, when you let go, it won't, of course, just activate. You have to uh, the, the slot is over here on the toy, on the back by his tailbone right by the base of his tail, push it down, and that's when he starts to walk. So he can walk with a big card. So of course, he can't really walk that well in my hand, but um, still not bad. And he's still walking. He's carrying the Night of the Museum trivia card, or he can carry his own card, Rexy, like that. So, um, pretty cool. I, I, I really like it. Um, and I like the, I mean, there's not a whole lot of detail, like super detail, um, but it's still not bad for what it is. I mean, it's one color, but it still looks like a really good toy, I think, especially for kids. Uh, it's a simple wind-up feature, but hey, it's the T-Rex from the movie. For whatever reason, Hollywood loves T-Rexes, um, you know, ever since Jurassic Park, or maybe even before that. Um, of course, in, in this uh, this summer, there's Night of the Museum too, and another movie, which you may have seen previous for Land of the Lost. There's another T-Rex there, and uh, also um, actually a thir another third one, um, Ice Age, uh, which will be the next f uh, series of Happy Meal toys. Um, there's another T-Rex uh, character, or two T-Rex characters there. So really, really interesting how Hollywood loves um, not only penguins as we've seen before, but of course T-Rexes as well. <laughs> So, um, that's pretty much Rexy. Uh, I definitely give this a uh, rating of uh, four and a half out of five. Really good. Um, definitely pick it up if you're collecting these uh, 
Man in the Museum, Happy Meal Toys, really cool stuff. So um, thank you guys for watching, and until uh, next time, I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks. Bye.